How about it, everybody? Big Bruce here bringing another video from Big Bad Small Cars. And uh, some more goodies from my mom. Do that eBay hunting. Love when she does some eBay hunting. I did crack this, but I didn't really open it up all the way to look. I figured I'd share that with you guys. I'm excited about this one, guys. Really excited about that, this one. I know what it is, but I don't really know what it is. A little bit of condition and all that. I did kind of look at a couple pictures, but I, there's a few of them that she was looking at, so I'm not sure which one. It's a Lesney case. Oh. Little dirty, but uh, it's from 1965. So what do you expect? It's actually in pretty damn good shape. I mean, 65, there's a lot of you guys that ain't nowhere near that age. There are a few of you guys that I'm friends with and I talk to on here that are. No offense to you guys. But look at the shape of that thing, man. That's just cherry. Just absolutely sweet, man. So let's crack into this thing. It smells like mothballs. It smells like it was in grandma's attic for a long time. Mmm. It's got some cars in it. I don't know how many. God, they just don't make stuff like this anymore. This thing's in great shape, man. Little trays in here. Let's see what we got. Oh, oh, smell the oldness. Oh god. Oh, it smells like grandma and grandma's attic. Grandma and grandma. Lesbian grandmas. Sorry guys. Uh wow. Check it out, guys. It's in really good shape, man. For being as old as it is, it's got a little smashage. Smashage, smashage. Inside, I can't talk today. These cars are super old, super played with. Love it played with. Love Lesney. Oh, so let's look through the first tray. God, it smells so old. I love that old smell. That old matchy smell. Mmm, smells like Lesney. Peterbilt. Drove trucks for a long time, man. Me and my dad both Peterbilt guys. My stepdad taught me how to drive, man. We drove together for years until I just couldn't do it no more. She used to be the uh, concrete truck, I do believe. I've got a couple of these. They're all pretty rough, but that's okay. I don't mind. These were played outside with in the dirt. Somebody loved their matchbox cars, and well, now I love them. You know me, I do not care about condition at all. BMW 580i. Super played with. Love it. Look how dirty it is, guys. Oh, God, I love dirty cars. Door still open. Yeah. Give me that dirty car. Oh, such a dirty car. I oh, love it. Love it. Oh, this one's even got rust. Oh, natural. Oh, yeah. Old Corvette. I like Corvettes like this. It like belongs in the boneyard. Oh, yeah. Case is in great shape, man. The cars are a little toasted. But love the cars. Mmm. Oh, God, it smells so old. Another Pete. Oh, no, this is not a Pete built. Sorry, guys. This would be a K dub. Mm -hmm. A studio sleeper. Some kid loved their trucks, man. And then he grew up to be a truck driver and hates trucks now. A little flatbed. A little rust on the wheels. Yeah. Mm. Love it. 81 on the bottom. I let Matchbox get away with butthole windows. It's okay as long as they're dirty butthole windows. I think he's great, dude. A Volvo. Ooh, here's one. Oh, I like this. I think this is a tow truck. Is it? Yeah, police. This is a tow truck. Somebody played the crap out of this, man. How dirty it is. Ugh. Dirty, dirty matchbox truck. This thing's great. Uh, the chrome plating's all gone off it. Down to the green plastic. Oh, my hands smell like Granny's house. Oh, fire truck. It's the 
home truck. I'm surprised this is still up here, man. That's really the shape it's in. It's cool, man. It's absolutely awesome. Love it. Bronco. It's really not that bad of shape. You can clean it up a little bit. A little wash. I want to take the patina off it, though. Yeah. Mm. Another little flatbed with even more rust. Oh, yeah. I like when my Matchbox cars make me feel like I'm supposed to have a tetanus shot. Oh, just gorgeous. I don't know what does it for you guys, but this does it for me. Somebody painted over my truck. Some kid's custom job. Did a pretty good job. He blacked it all out pretty good. Murdered it. He's like that blue one that uh, Doug and his wife sent me. That's cool. I'm going to customize it even more. So that's the first case. It's really actually the first little box is in pretty good shape. A couple little smashed up bits there. Love it. Can't get it with that old musty, mothball-y smell. Oh, nothing in that one. It's okay, man. The case is what I was after. I've been hunting old Hot Wheels and Matchbox cases and making it Wesney's even better because I have some mint condition cars to go into this. They're from the same time and stuff. So the shape is actually quite remarkable. Absolutely wonderful. Loving it. Set that aside. I got another box. I think my mom said she accidentally bit it on this one. But nonetheless, it is a great little car. I did crack it already. I mean, it's already opened. Matchbox. Happy Wheel. Happy Wheels. Matchbox Happy Wheels. Enjoy, everybody. Uh, Matchbox Happy Days. 56. A little Ford pickup. This thing is cool. Of course, I don't mind them already being cracked. It's in this box. Look how pretty this is, guys. Love it. Not a scratch on it. Beautiful piece to add to my collection. Thank you, Mom. Love you. Really nice car. Absolutely love it. Yeah, guys. I appreciate everybody watching, man. Uh, I know it's kind of a short video, man. But a lot of people like short videos anyways. I get a little long-winded and get showing off all the cars. And one more video to do uh, today of a lot that I bought from a local uh, collector that I became friends with, uh, Ben and stuff and a couple pieces that I picked up from the stores but uh yeah man I hope everybody enjoyed the old uh the old matchbox cars god I love that smell yeah but uh yeah do me a favor guys hit subscribe man feel free to leave comments man check me out on Instagram as always man take it easy